second game, Curtis, second defeat, and just sort us through how, how it's laid out. Yeah, I mean, first half was. We've gone from the sublime to the ridiculous, really. You know, to play so well Saturday in that first half was was uh, yeah an eye opener for me. I think over the two games that I've been here, I've had a I've had a little taste of a little bit of everything. Um, and it's not acceptable to play like we played in that first half, where there's no fight, no energy, no desire. I always say a football team has to represent the manager. So to watch my team play like we did first half, I just won't accept that. Um, second half a lot better. But our inability to um, to keep anything close to a clean sheet. I mean, we've got the worst defensive record in the league. We've played two games, conceded six goals against two teams that are down near the bottom. So the problems are as clear as a nose on my face, and we're desperate for some time on the training ground. You know, you know, defensively we're, we're, we're all over the place. Um, our shape's not right, so we need some um, we need some work on the training ground for sure. Yeah, so obviously we've gone from that fast flowing football that we saw on Saturday, obviously with the, the boys goal that was posted all over Twitter, um, to the sort of long ball we saw tonight. Was that a deliberate change or? Well, I, th I think it was so windy. Um, it, was, it was very difficult to play any sort of football tonight. But yeah, we were way too direct. Didn't get any quality into our footmen whatsoever, um, and we looked like it was a little bit too much for a few few lads tonight. So. Yeah, was there a little bit of a reluctance to, to change the shape? Obviously, not a time on the chain, training ground with the lads uh, still trying to drill that into them, sort of thing. Yeah, definitely. I'm just trying to find out about what we've got at the club. You know, where where we're at, um, players wise, what we need. Um, so the, the the two games have been a good um, fact finding uh, time for me, really, to kind of find out you know where, where we're at with everything. And um, I don't I, I don't think I could have got a better review for the two games because I have seen. A little bit of everything you know we've had two five goal thrillers if you want to call them that um so yeah it's been a it's been a it's been a Yeah, so are you just a, a little bit concerned? Obviously, Whitby won tonight as well. They're, they're down there with us. Uh, two teams that were below us coming in the fixtures have, have both beaten us. Is that a bit concerning for yourself? No, I, I think, like I said, we've got more than enough here to be uh, more than comfortable. Um, but we've got to start proving it. Like I said, we do, I'm desperate to get them on the training ground and actually work through some, some things rather than just kind of bouncing from game to game with no no time on the on the training ground. But yeah, like I'm not, I'm not. There's plenty. Of points still to play for, so there's not, it's not alarming whatsoever yet. So we'll, we'll be absolutely fine. Like I said, we just need a few more bodies in and uh, a little bit of time on training. Yeah. So just how much time behind the scenes are you and the, the rest of the coaches staff putting in to to get those bodies in? Yeah. Well, on the phone pretty much 24/7. Um, you know, they've got to be the right players as well. You know, they've, they've got to be good enough to come in and, and improve us. And we've got some good players here. It's, it's not a case for need to play new players. Um, we've got some good players here, but we're, we're desperate for help. Yeah, and then just just looking ahead to, to Saturday, Warrington Town, high flying at the minute. They're uh, currently occupying the playoff spots. How do we go about preparing for that and picking the lads up? Well, we, we've got training Thursday. You know, we'll review this evening on Thursday, um, see where we need to improve, and rest a few players up as well. We've got three or four that are carrying knocks, which isn't ideal. Um, so we rest and recover, and we'll be we'll be right for Saturday, and we'll go there and we'll give them a game. You know, on. We, in parts during the game, we've looked like a really, really good side, and in other parts, we, we've looked not a great side. We, we need to get some consistency in our performance from game to game. Even from 15 minutes to 15 minutes, we're a little bit either brilliant or, or all over the place, so we, we definitely need that.